Hi everybody, Jeremy here from Video Editor Studio and today I'm going to show you how to create a shaky text in DaVinci Resolve 17 on the edit page. Let's check it out. Alright, so we are in DaVinci Resolve 17 right now, we're on the edit page and first off you need to bring a text to your timeline. So go to Effect Library right here. You're gonna go over to titles and here you want to bring text plus because uh, it's gonna give you more flexibility than just text uh, you can do more customization and more animation if you want to another thing is that you can just use a pre-made title a template uh, like for example um, or free template right here uh, link in description you can download them for free and try them for yourself so i'm gonna bring one right here uh, and we can make this one shaky too so we're gonna make um, shaky this one and this one it's gonna be very simple we're gonna go over to open fx and here what we want to bring is the shake camera effect so we're gonna bring it on this one and we're gonna bring it on this one as you can see it works on both text on this one and on this one so now just for the detail you can do a lot of things uh, to customize it because as you can see right now it's not really shaky it's just moving around um, you go over to the inspector you click on effect and here you have basically access to all the parameter that you can modify i'm gonna quickly run you through it but test them for yourself and see what works uh, the best for you here uh, you have motion scale which basically increase the motion or reduce the motion so really as you can see it's creating more motion and if we make it slower, there is no motion. So you choose how much you want, then the speed. Here, as you can see, there is no speed, nothing happening. And here, the speed is at the maximum. Then we have the motion blur. Uh, things to note is that the motion blur is gonna be quite taxing on your system and it might not uh, render at um, real time playback. Then to make it actually shaky, that's into um, those parameters that you want to tap in. Mostly here, right now in rotation, we don't have almost any rotation. So we want to bring more rotation. That's gonna bring a more shaky effect. And we're gonna reduce basically the pan and the tilt, especially the tilt. Okay. And we want to increase the PTR speed. That's what's gonna give like a real shake effect. Um, the pan amplitude, we're gonna reduce that too. Here we go. As you can see, it's very, so most of the time, if you want to create like a sh shaky effect, you're gonna reduce the pan amplitude, you're gonna reduce uh, the tilt amplitude, and instead, what you're gonna bring up is gonna be the uh, PTR speed, and uh, the rotation amplitude, and also the speed scale, probably, uh, right here. If you want, let's say, to make an increase going from slow to big, you can do that also here, where you can uh, kind of keyframe it. At the beginning, it's going slower, and then you can increase it towards the end and make it very uh, quick. Let's check it out. And it's getting quicker and quicker. Just play around with it. Check what works best for you. Uh, it's gonna be the same thing uh, on this one. Uh, you just basically modify the effect as you want. And that's pretty much everything that you need to know in order to create a shaky text. Let me know in the comment what kind of video you would like to see in the future. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you in the next one. Bye. Improve your video and speed up your workflow by using easy to use drag and drop templates made specifically for DaVinci Resolve. Check it out on our website, videoeditorstudio.com.